all collectively, and everyone yeah. got... <laughs> you know what the sad thing is? The reason I got Cypher Sivir Action, it's a really good Legends of Runeterra deck, and I'm like, that's a parrot! <laughs> You're ready to talk about Runeterra. I'm ready to talk about Sivir Action. Okay, Centaurin. Wow, okay, Inspired actually going to go for the early smite to make sure he's uh, got health right now, because there is going to be a potential dive. Or is there? Burns the W. Jungler's still looking back at each other. Centaurin has smite to take away the big Krug. It's the lion's share of the XP, though not the gold. That's all in the back half. But he knows with where you can see Inspired, there's a Smite, and there's the play. Inspired on the side now. Here comes the walk-in. Debbie should be on cooldown. Who's going to pull aggro? Stun's going to come in first. The flash follow. Wants to get out. The shield takes it. He's out of range. And will he trade it back? Inspired gets pillared. St. Jordan wants it. Takes a bite out of crime. Two to one. Team Elect. Now Impact, of course. Level 6, though, is going to be very safe here. I can't imagine him dying to level 4. No item trundle. Control over the wall. Jumps across it. By the way, Inspired's here. Good luck, buddy. But Core JJ is here. They outnumber. Flash Q stun. The rest of the follow up is there. Team Lick with the side. We are going to be top. Being his teammate for a year, but not the case there. Able to get taken down. Now things are looking really rough for the Gwen. Punch that. Uh, Whippo? I guess he's fine. He but... has ult as well. Oh, he like yeah, he almost has enough damage to full kill. W? Okay, that's really late, buddy. <laughs> uh, I mean, he's fine, but that is a as it feels like, because they're already walking up, and guess what? 2v1, good luck, buddy. Has Ignite, has ulti, burns it now, wants the regen, and here's the dunk to start things out. Finds the stun as well. Pillars in the way. Gonna find a lot of damage. The punch coming through. Bubble drops the aggro. 100 HP left, and Trundle gonna knock him down. Team Liquid. A lot of the most kills in the league through this time period. It's once they get these leads, they start trading out for more objectives than people feel like they need to. And so from here, I think a lot of people want to see Team Liquid keep this pace up. Core JJ all over the map. Santorin all over the map. Trying for the regen down the top side. Whippo, no, does have ult. Does not have his flash. Gonna dunk back towards safety by a bit of space right here. Still has the shield. It will not matter. They'll get him. Oh my word! That Gore Drinker! That gore Drinker was massive! And Whippo straight up 1v2s. No matter which jungler comes top lane, impact dies. Whippo just destroyed them with the massive haymaker and during the fat shield, able to use his Gore Drinker to jump up a couple hundred more. HP finish that kill and still be on the map to push now with the Rift Herald. Oh, he'll barely finish DP in time. He's thankful that Herald's gonna uh, sort of summon slowly, but this turret will always die to the charge. Gold will be earned. Whippa getting low again. Shield, Gore Drinker, turret's gone. How about the rest of the fight though? Once again, MP is living. Gone. He still just lives. Whippo still surviving. Jojo Pion is here, but is it more meat for the grinder? What's it gonna be now? Centaurin a bit low. Here comes Bjergsen, kills number three, kill number four. This game is so good. The perfect way the kit plays out. Guess what? The shield is bigger, the damage is bigger, the more damage you've taken. Gore Drinker is literally a missing health heal. You want to go to one. You can't just always look right at the stats. It might be because <laughs> the 4 1 and 4. Oh, oh that's a charm. That could be some danger. This man is in a 1v3. Yeah, he's running for his life. Misses the ulti. Jojo Pyon. Good fancy feet. Hansama. You can't look at the stats, but it writes 0 0 0, and it's because the man isn't dead. Burns the heal, here comes the rest of it, finally goes down, a nice shutdown comes through from the farm. Danny is on the board, EG has a small sign of life. Here's Wipo again, forced to flash away, second ult should be here, I believe. Knockup will tag, immunes it with the ulti, but he's gonna drop a gigantic shutdown. That gold grab, FT is still the gold, just blue, 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 blue. Sorry, Corey, you're a support. <laughs> Sorry, buddy, you don't even get turret plates. Second arrow goes down, Harold. On summon will be able to attack, no summoners, but has opened a spell shield. As he gets it lower and lower, this will be mid lane outer dropping all three other turrets. Will be slain. Team Liquid killing turrets. We had the dragon. Got 200 gold more expensive, was very OP. But moving towards maybe a death dance next up. Yeah, run away. Oh, pretty good killer though. They might find the engage. Danny doesn't have a good way around this one. Saves the ulti, walks back just barely, but they're gonna lose one. Inspired flashes back. Impact TP's in just to be attacked again. Quick cleanse out of Danny, trying to stay alive. Ignite is on, that means it might kill him. Just gonna be one tick shy, I think, and the shield comes in anyway. Impact, nowhere to go. Whipple finds the kill, two to nothing. Team Liquid keep taking whatever they want. You see EG's mentality. We should contest the dragon. They tried to group up mid, but there's just so little control over the game. Team Liquid easily pounce on top of them, grab a couple more kills, grab a turret. Gonna be over 8,000 gold for 20 minutes. A little yeah. bit of split, despite being nine and five in regular and oh. in record. Hi, Inspired. I've got two. I've got the knockup. We have enough damage. Those Vulcan comes in for the charm. The double knockup. Good damage to Danny. But here comes the reinforcements. We'll even be enough to find a single kill. They're gonna try, and they'll get Santorin. One for EG. Nothing back just yet. But here comes the dunk. It's gonna be Jojo Pyun dropping. A one for one. A Sivir gets on the board. Hansama. This entire jungle, and it's like, look, you have to walk through seven different pockets of vision. We could be in any one of them. Are you going to even make the play happen? So Hansama on the wings has the ulti popped. Impact buying some space. But now 
Uh, he may be buying the farm at this point. Uh, running back far enough away. He will stay up. EG still contesting pretty heavily. Inspire has to clone back out, but here's the dunk in. Gonna find three slows, and that could be enough for the kill. Inspired still pillared. He's gonna be dropping. Yes, indeed. Traffic cone. Back you go to the fountain. 5v4, no jungler. Baron's on the plate. Team Liquid find that quick pit kill after EG was looking for a flank, trying to contest vision a little bit. Not able to get anything done. Jungler down. Should be a pretty free Baron for them, but EG, they don't back down, man. No. Like mid-2000s movies, never back down. Never back down. This time around, though, might be a, a loss. Let's see if they can come through on the first engage. Looking for the best they can as Vulcan goes right back out of the front of the charm. Shuffle's going to be Zonia's, but Corey DJ has a stopwatch himself. There's one kill on for Santorin. Can he get the chase down? JoJo gets a single kill, but the long-form fight is 3-1. to one. A TP comes across, the recall out, and Team Liquid now. Look, he's still got four. He still have no jungler. This is going to be Baron. Team Liquid throw the gold lead to 9,000, soon to be 10 and a half. Poor JJ gives his body up for the team. Get those kills, get the Baron. Team Liquid looking good. Playing angry, it feels like, I two know. weeks. And so it makes sense that these tricky counter picks that he's trying to do are getting a lot of negative community criticism. But now we go to this one. The shuffle's back and forth. <laughs> JoJo Pin stays alive for now, but this man, uh, this man's gonna die. Uh, Sivir is there, the pizza hits him. Bjergsen is on a rampage now, 405 on a two item Azir. Uh, but yeah, I mean, you look at the, the sort of uh, opportunities that Pepo's had, and look, he has been playing a lot of a lot. Four games so far in the split behind his gangplank at five. But I feel like anecdotally, Team Liquid are having a worse split than in spring. And in spring, he was just playing a unique champion every game. Like, he went to go, like, narrow down the pool because they lost in playoffs, and it actually made the team, it feels like, look worse. Yeah, I, th I think there's been maybe Team Liquid, sometimes when you start stumbling a little bit like we said still one and one still by most metrics good but compared to their own standards they wanted more yeah sometimes you can get in your own head about well what should we be doing and you start really over analyzing a lot of things and i think for whippo his personality is these unique picks and you kind of have to unlock him so yeah. that he can take over a game and absolutely 1v9 like this one and he's doing it right now of course some help from his jungler but it's going to be mid lane dropping and here comes the team fight dunk comes across oh. goodbye to the gwen 5v4 good luck for the flank buddy inspired comes in for a second and drops just as fast and now in a 3v5 there's not much you can do jj is here he'll find a stun he'll find a heal and he will find his oh he does he get there the but he will find his death i don't think 2v4 is much of a defense here danny is going to be hiding behind the turrets right now with his lane mate and to be fair, the bot lane is one, two, and six. The EG bot lane tried their hardest. It's not gonna be enough. Team Liquid top dip the whole way through. A ton of coordination through Whippo, Santorin, Bjergsen, and Core JJ. They slammed every one of those lane matchups, and they're gonna be looking to kill the last few EG members. Nexus falls, and TL crushes the doubters. Team Liquid break the one and one streak. They